Welcome to the audio recording in practice, part 2 video course of the Video Teach project. During this course, you will be familiarized with the process of sound recording for video production. In the first part of this course about audio recording, you learned how to prepare before you start audio recording. The process of recording itself consists of 1. microphones, 2. equipment setup, 3. adjusting levels, 4. recording, 5. keeping audio files The first step in the preparation for audio recording is to decide whether to use a single audio recording system or a double audio recording system. Single audio recording systems are convenient for capturing sound in a variety of environments, but occasionally the audio quality that they record can differ. Better audio quality can be achieved with double audio recording system, but it would require multiple devices and a more complicated setup. A microphone is a device which can transform sound into an electrical signal. There are several different types of microphones with many variations. The shotgun microphone is usually used on movie sets. It is held by a crew member who places it over the heads of the speakers to keep it out of the picture. A handheld microphone is designed to be held in the hands of the speakers or reporters. It can capture a good quality sound outdoors. It is easy to use and portable. Lavalier microphone is a very small microphone that can be clipped on the clothes of the speaker. It is usually used indoors since most of these microphones easily pick up also background noise. And built-in microphone. Every smartphone and every modern recording camera has a built-in microphone. These are very useful allowing you to capture sound effortlessly with every video you record. However, these microphones generally offer poor quality audio recording and you have limited control over the microphone settings. How to set up equipment correctly. The first step, microphone placing. The right place for a microphone cannot be predicted, you must find it. Therefore, be ready to experiment, listen to the audio to be recorded. and move the microphone around the space until you find a position where the audio sounds most balanced the mic should not be too far from the source of sound because it will pick up a lot of background noise but it cannot be too close either because the sound has to have space to develop to appear natural the second step connect the microphone to an audio interface or directly to a recording device you can connect the microphone using a cable or wirelessly the third step Test the quality of the audio before you start recording and keep controlling the recorded sound during the video making. Now let me tell you something about adjusting levels for recording. The optimal levels for recording are set and adjusted using recording software or audio interface. The audio levels have to be constantly monitored during video recording in order to maintain strong signal and to avoid distortion. Once you are ready with the setup and adjusting you can start video and audio recording in order to capture a high quality audio you can make additional adjustments during the recording process since the specific characteristics of the sound source the voice of the speaker for example can fluctuate at times once the recording is completed you have to make sure that you can store your audio files properly there are different audio file formats uncompressed audio formats which store the audio file without compressing it formats with lossless compression compress the audio file without losing any of the information lossy formats compress the audio file reducing its size but in the process some of the information is lost and the quality of the recording is diminished recording the audio of your video is a process that requires skills and creativity The quality of the equipment can play a role but crucial for the end result should be your experience as an audio creator your curiosity and willingness to experiment Thank you very much for watching this learning video If you like it you can continue following us on YouTube or our other channels such as Facebook or the official website of the project video teach at videoteach.eu All the content of this project has been produced through the international collaboration of nine expert partners and is funded by the European Union.